So we've had a lot of laughs throughout this journey, but let's take it down a notch because all emotion will gently fade throughout the course of this next mission, which simply involves going underwater against Daniil. You would think that this is a boss fight, but in reality, it's a ham-fisted PSA on brushing your teeth because the eel, the eel, has dirty teeth, of course. So naturally, Mario sprays his water gun underwater to clean those pearly whites. The reason this mission is so difficult is not due to the comprehension check the logic requires, but rather that your life bar is all you got. You can find a few coins here and there, but this eel typically requires you to hover above him and brush his teeth from above. And sadly, we don't have such luxuries. Your best bet is to stand beside him and spray mindlessly hoping that the water clips through not only the water, but his thick skin as well. If you didn't manage to clean all of his teeth before he throws a tantrum, well, I hope you like drowning. I won't bore you with further details, but you have to understand that my therapist claims that this has had a heavy effect on me mentally, and the closure I got for beating the level was honestly not enough. Because then, Mario gets softlocked. Yep, if you don't have enough speed built up or a path in mind when you get to control Mario again, he doesn't get to escape, since the eel's death cutscene takes Mario back to the center. And also, why did the eel die? In a game with sentient flowers and magical water guns, how is this the most flawed strand of logic that this eel doesn't want his teeth brushed, and by brushed, I mean have high-velocity water inside low-velocity water gently pass by before he goes into a downward spiral like my sanity and then forfeit a magical piece of sunshine? What even are the sprites? If brushing his teeth killed the eagle, are we truly good people just because we can now drink the water? Uh, well, you know, just keep trying until it eventually works. And you know what? That's not really bad advice for life either. 